Yes. But let's see how this is gonna let's go. Let's go. Tries to get the tranquilizer. Oh. He loves that tranquilizer. Yeah. I've seen the DD side B. They buffed it again. It's really good. It's ridiculous. Like it's the, the so it has good. It has such good priority. It yeah. beats a lot of moves. And, and uh, it can go through shield. But I was saying, uh, Prof's tranquilizer tricks. Um, he seems to use a lot more tranquilizer than most snakes. I, I watched Rolex play at uh, at Apex, yeah. and Rolex only seemed to use uh, to use tranquilizer in tech chases. Like when he get knocks the opponent down, he predicts the opponent is gonna tech roll to the right or to the left, and he tries to hit that Definitely tranquilizer. There we see Professor Pro with his grenade with wow. his uh, grenade tricks. He drops them and then he holds them in his shield. Yeah, and then forces the opponent to come on him. Yeah, exactly. Because he uses his uh, first. That's, that's actually as bait. <gasps> wow. Oh, and here we see a really Incredible. good setup. Incredible. But he setup. missed, yeah. But he missed the setup. He or he missed the upper. But but that trick with the grenade is a classic brawl trick. That's, yeah. that's something most snake players love to do in brawl. Just hold the grenade, hope the opponent gets greedy and attacks your shield, and then eat the grenade and try yeah. and get something out of it. Except that in brawl, all you get is a mix up. In this game, you can get big combos out of that. <laughs> so let's see. That was wow, really nice of very nice combo. But it looked he like he knew exactly when to throw on that grenade also. Because he didn't get hit by it. Sizable lead for Prof still. Yeah, and, and here we see him containing space with his bananas. He couldn't roll on either side or hit slide on them. Nice follow-ups. Spot dodge into down smash. We see some peanut poppers from Diddy. Now there and is a really nice death smash. That death smash is really hard to dodge yeah. because of its three hits that can hit in various speeds. And you know, there's a, there's a saying in Brawl, even if you're on the same stock and you have a 60% a oh. against Snake, it's not a lead. So, <laughs> <laughs> so being behind against Snake is even worse because it's very difficult to make a comeback against this character. <laughs> he just never dies. He never dies, dude. Nice forward smash. Nice to finish his stock. Throws at a banana. Oh. But still behind in percent by yep. a lot. But oh. it's he can rack up damage fast. And we don't see any projectiles on the screen by very Professor nice Pro movement. right now. Very nice movement by Kiwi. Yep. And Professor Pro hasn't laid any C4 or any mine on the screen. Wow. Oh, that Amazing fantastic DI. DI. Oh, oh. E DJ Nintendo would be proud. <laughs> oh, 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 If he had back air, that would have killed. Yeah. He has a C4 out. But we're not Captain Hindsight. No. We're oh, he's going to throw him on the. Yeah. Oh, wow. Throw him on the mine. Extremely smart play by Really Prof. smart. Gets the up air. But not much out of it. Oh, oh wow. wow. That was sneaky. Oh. Oh, oh, wow, the shenanigans. Oh, my God. Oh. The fucking oh, wow. shenanigans, dude. Kiwi is going a bit too hard. Oh. Kiwi is going a bit too He's hard. He's going to survive? No. Oh, he fast fall back yeah. and then died. Because it's of it. actually pretty hard to do it in uh, Project M. You, ha you have to press down, but only slightly, because yeah. if, you, if you press full down, you just fast fall and you to your death. Ooh. Generally, you want to buffer it from your B. Yeah. If you do it afterwards, it's very unlikely. It's very likely that you will fast fall. Oh, losing loads of percent there. Oh, but nice. a banana. Oh, oh, barrel cancel. This is a close first match. Oh, oh my God! What very a beautiful nice. last match. Great read. And this is oh, this is this is a bad position. Wow, that beautiful was so that was really good. smart. That was really smart. He put. He put him in a terrible position. The mine was there, so he couldn't just roll in the stage or walk into the stage. And he put the C4 on the platform so that it would cover all options. Yep. That was fantastic. Good job. The only way Kiwi could have avoided that is waiting for the, the, t the platform to move away from him and yeah. then try and get come up to the stage from a high route. But he so what do you think Kiwi would want to ban against Rolex? No ro big not stages, Rolex, big stages. You don't not Rolex, but Professor Pro. You don't want to let Professor Pro play his game, and yep. his game is projectiles. He's going back to the same <laughs> stage, though. His game is projectiles and frustration. 
he yeah. frustrates you into falling into his nonsense. <laughs> that it, they went straight into oh, the stage and almost... Doesn't get the spike hit Yeah, us. we just talked about that. Nice. I haven't seen much use of this, of, uh, of his side B simply as a grab. He mostly seems very to go into the kick. Again. And that's very smart because he knows Prof is 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 shielding the, the kick version of it a yeah. lot. So now he's uh, taking a match. Right? Though I think it's a bit early in the match to do that. Dash attack, very punishable if you don't do something out of it. Oh, <laughs> just a slight spacing there. Trying to hit him into the mine, but Professor Pro knows his setup. Professor Pro is also very, also does something very nice, which is that he shields the entire dash attack. Yeah. Most most people they fall for the multiple hits of the dash attacks, which can sometimes throw you off because you try to release the shield too early. Yeah. And you get hit. But oh, Prof is beautiful recovery by Professor Prof is knowledgeable now. enough to shield the whole Oh! Thing. Wow. <laughs> that was really good. And Prof gets killed by his own mind. Yeah. That's the double-edged sword of Snake. Yes. <laughs> we have oh, it. wow. He did Banana did he get the C4? Yeah, the C4 is on Diddy yeah. Kong. I can see it. It's on his oh, foot. Oh, wow. He waits, but... Oh, oh the footstool! Oh, wow. The read was fantastic, but he did the tranquilizer too early, and it didn't hit. And another... A beautiful another, conversion another, out of that grab. Another four there. Here we see the helicopter. Kiwi is get, seems to be getting a bit too aggressive and flustered. Yeah. Oh! And, and he's trying for that again. He's taking a lot of damage doing so, and you don't want to trade with Snake because Snake never dies, and did he die? Beautiful use of that Nair. And oh and wow! He got him. Tranquilizer gun to fair to finish that. He he he, he used the four there to hit with the 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 horizontal hitbox, and yep. that was very smart. And here comes the cop out. Salty run back with Fox. Bird with Fox. And this is the cop out, as we all know. Yep. Now, Kiwi is a Fox main. Oh, we got some water. Fantastic. Sorry, guys, we're just being served some water. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. The crowd is very oh, excited for Prof. A pro. Just played against Leffen. Ah, oh, fantastic water. Anyway, tries to chase him with the upper. Now, Kiwi is a fox main, very technical, very good. And um, Kiwi has just seen Leffen beat Professor Pro 3-0 yep. with Fox, so he might have taken a bit what he saw. To his oh, but a technical error there. Unfortunate. He tried to shield, but he didn't realize he was off the stage. Oh, but beautiful. And That's he air dodged. Oh, wow. He, bait, he baited a reaction from... Oh! Oh, oh my goodness, my Prof's mind games are out of this world right now. Nice recovery there, going up for the platform instead of going to the stage. They're doing it again, it's really good. It seems like the it's other match is over, but we have no idea who won. What? I would like to be informed on who won Fuzziness versus Ice. Yeah. Does someone know? I don't know. Oh, well. We found out better after see Snake taking two stocks now. Three stocks. Nice damage from that up up air. Oh. 21%, that's a lot. Do you see fake to see for that? Really smart. Trying to get him when he landed with a tranquilizer. And this gun, tranquilizer only stuns if if you're grounded. Yeah, if it hits you while you're in the air, air, you just lose all momentum. And this is why I think uh, Rolex only likes to use it in tech chases, because in tech chases, the opponent usually doesn't doesn't have time to jump. So he will always be grounded, and he will always get stunned. But Prof has a more liberal use of the tranquilizer. He uses yep. it in the neutral oh. game a lot more. And the grenade bait. And I think it does have its, its uses, but it might be a bit risky. Oh, he wanted that back air there, but it was really close. Nice up air. Nice. But this is going to be a mountain to climb for Fox. Definitely. It's going to have any, to work real hard. Any hit is going to kill, this. and this is going to be nice. it. Fantastic. That tranquilizer gun. Great performance by Prof. Too fair. Second time he did that. You want On your the water? last dog. Yeah, fine. Okay. 